memorial to the man and his music. Julie Gatenby reports. The icon of glam rock, Mark Bolan and T-Rex blazed onto the stage in 1970. His fans adored him. He was exciting, he was glamorous, he epitomized the 70s. But it was in September 1977 that Mark Bolan and his girlfriend Gloria Jones were driving home along this road. She was driving, came over the bridge, lost control and smashed into the tree. Mark died instantly. He was 29. Gloria, who was a singer, was lucky to survive. She recovered, but her throat was so badly damaged, she never sang again. Hundreds of fans gathered with family and friends for the funeral at Golders Green. 25 years on, many of those faces appeared again today. I used to like more of the acoustic, slower stuff he used to do. I, I used to go round his house and listen, and they say, well, what do you think of that? I said, well, that's a good one. He said, well, that's not commercial then, and put it in the cupboard. I, I, I look at it this way. This was, is what Mark would want. He's still in the limelight. People told me 25 years, there'd still be a following and still people coming to see the group. I wouldn't have believed them. But even after 25 years, dedicated fans had commissioned the statue, unveiled today by Mark and Gloria's son, Roland, who was a year old when his father died. The 25th anniversary, this has been quite more of a celebration. I feel a little bit more comfortable with it, so it's quite exciting to see my family and see the support which people are giving my dad this many years later. So as, as emotional as it is, it's like I put myself aside and I'm here for my family and my dad. So a father who won't be forgotten and a pop idol whose reputation has carried him into the 21st century. Julie Gatenby, BBC London News, in Barnes.